Hey everyone, Doug Matuzak, Boa Basement, Frank Viscani, Boa Evolutions on the video. What's what's happening? What's happening? Uh, we're just showing a little litter here born uh, back on the 25th. Ah, uh, the 24th. 24th of May. And uh, unfortunately we didn't get what we were really looking for. This was from that uh, the crazy uh, calico slash granity type animals. And uh, we're really hoping to have uh, hit on some of those sorts of animals. But uh, out of 21, 22 little babies, uh, nothing came through. And, and yes, by the way, the animals were brother and sister. So, you know, we were hoping for something to happen in that aspect. But at this moment, nothing. So I'll uh, probably repeat the breeding one more time in the future and see if we have something pop up. But uh, everything was double het for sharp, strained snow. And the father uh, was a uh, hypo to boot, as well as his uh, wacky appearance. So what we have here is basically what you get out of a uh, double het for snow. Uh, basically het for anatheristic, het for sharp strain albino, bred to a hypo double het for sharp strain snow. So you got anneries, you got ghosts, got some normals, got some hypos. The variety pack. Got, got a few albinos, maybe a sun glow or two, uh, snow, some ghosts. Yep, little little party pack of animals, so. Yeah, but guys will be seeing this stuff in about uh, a month or so after we get a few meals in them. Let them shed and get some meals in them and get them all properly sexed and get their cute little faces on the website and have you guys pick them out. Crazy enough, I produced ghost boas 14 years ago in 2000, and I'll probably end up keeping one of these because I only got one in the house, and she's 14 years old. So, <laughs> but there you go, the little party pack from basically typo double head for sharp strain snow to double head to sharp strain snow.